What's up everybody, Lord PDTV here to give you some information and news, a little bit of an update that we have been privi privileged to have about our, the game Grey Zone Warfare. So Grey Zone Warfare, as we've always spoken about, is you know you play with a group of other teammates and you are trying to end up taking over other points of uh, the map of Langome. Now, the thing I wanted to kind of talk to you about is that we just got informed that they had this amazing interview uh, with uh, this individual called Spicy. Um, he ended up uh, talking to them about, you know, the different types of uh, tactics and things that they ended up doing. Now, it was very interesting to kind of sit there and listen to what he ended up saying uh, because you really kind of learn what he ended up, like, you know, what his special forces kind of taught him how to do. Uh, you know, instead of, like, if you have a uh, an operative where you have to go and you have to kind of retrieve information, you know, you don't want to go directly into the town and kind of just talk to people and try to get information. You try to get information from the town outside and then go in. Now, what Rick was kind of explaining and talking is that, you know, you can get these types of quests or missions from the rat's nest being, you know, your home base, you know, they give you your quest. They say, Hey, we need you to go get this information about this and this person. So what you end up doing is you end up, you know, you end up gearing up the way you need to gear up. So if it's just a, like, you know, a thing where you're going to go in, talk to some guy and you're supposed to get out. You know, you want to end up dressed lightly, so you go in, you dress with very lightly, no extra gear, you go in, you talk to some civilians on the outside of town, you learn that information, and then you go in. And then that was those three types of things are kind of interesting because they're not the normal mindset of, you know, what gamers are kind of used to playing as. My thought is always, hey, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to get all my stuff, I'm going to gear up, go in, just destroy everything, and then get out. But in this case, you know, he kind of really gave a lot of insight to the special tactics and things that they ended up doing, the gear, the you know, all of that is very, very interesting. And it's something that I kind of just like wanted to say and kind of bring up, um, because they, they're bringing up a lot of information and a lot of things that are going on about the game, and it is really progressing from what we see very, very quickly, a lot quicker than I was ex personally expecting uh, to see, and hopefully we'll end up getting some gameplay soon. Uh, I'm not going to really go crazy in, in depth on, on lots of different information about the game, other than I think that where it is right now and where it is stepping forward is that it's actually getting a lot closer to, you know, you know, a, a, an alpha so we can actually get our hands on it and kind of go through it. Um, it seems like they've taken a lot of the core elements of different types of games. You know how like Escape from Tarkov, you know, you build up your gear set and you go in, um, and like, you know, it matters, but I don't think it matters to the extent that this is kind of bringing up to it. So, you know, I think that this is going to have a lot more detailed information based on what you're going to end up doing, where you're going to go, and how you're going to operate with each. And I think that is vastly important to bring up. Now, the the missions and the quests and everything, they kind of have kept uh, under lock and key, other than like those types of quests, the kind of, hey, you're going to go in and talk to a guy. There's probably going to be assassination quests and things like that. Uh, the other, And I would like to say that those like meetings that we ended up having to be able to communicate with people, I think is really, really cool and really, really informative to kind of see and listen to. So um, I can't wait to get some gameplay. Um, hopefully myself and the other, uh, you know, Iron Lords podcast team members and, you know, Lords of Gaming.net team members can kind of get together and we can get some time on this game, uh, hopefully soon. So, and, uh, you know, I'm praying that they're actually able to be a PAX East so we can actually sit down. I can actually have a, a couple of really cool conversations with developers, but we'll see how that goes. So, uh, we'll see that, um, you know, very, very soon. So, uh, so please keep an eye out and, uh, I hope to see you all soon. Thank you very much for checking out the video and uh, I'll see you all, um, you know, on the next video. All right. Thanks. Bye everybody.